may adlaw na itong danan. If you want to get rid of your double chin, you might want to watch this video. Hi, I'm Nathan. I'm your occupational therapist. And my goal is to help you be more consistent with your therapy at home. Before we do the exercises, now will be a good time to take a selfie and we will compare those pictures after a few weeks of doing the exercises. And please send those comparison pictures in my Instagram, which I will be linking down below. You may think that getting rid of the double chin is just very superficial or just for aesthetic purpose, but it also improves the strength of your jawline and your entire mouth which you need for eating, for swallowing, and for talking. But let's admit it, getting rid of the double chin will really improve your confidence and your ability to move on and be consistent with your therapy and your self-improvement. There are several reasons why you might have developed a double chin and the most common reason is weight gain and another reason is your diet. So try to do your exercises, be consistent with it, and take a look at your diet. If you have a high sugar intake, if this is not turned into energy, sugar is stored as fat. And if you consume a lot of salty food, it retains water. And that makes your face puffy and rounded. It makes the double chin very obvious. So now let's do those exercises and follow with me. First exercise is kissing the heavens. So we are going to look up and kiss. We're going to do that 10 times, all right? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Do that 10 times, three sets. The second exercise is jaw jut. So we're bringing our lower lip over our upper lip like that, but we are going to look up. We will be holding this for 30 seconds, all right? Let's go. and that is jaw jut. Third exercise is fish mouth. So it is just like the second exercise, which is the jaw jut, but we are going to open and close your mouth. So it is like this. Okay, so we will do that 10 times, all right? Let's go. Look up, open and close your mouth, lower lip over the upper lip. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that is fish mouth. The next exercise is what they call mewing. So mewing is done like this. You're going to bring the tip of your tongue behind your front teeth like this. And then after you bring your the rest of your tongue up towards your upper palate. So and then close your mouth. Once it is there, try to swallow your spit. So your throat will go up and down, but more going up. So I'll show you again. Okay, so let's try to do that 10 times, all right? So tip of your tongue, back of your the back of your front teeth, and then the rest of the tongue goes up towards your upper palate. All right, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, 
eight, nine, ten. You can also hold this for about 30 seconds if you cannot uh, swallow or spit. Do this 10 times 3 sets if you can. The next exercise you will need either a ball that is soft enough to squeeze or if you don't have a ball you can just get your face towel or a washcloth, fold it twice and then roll it up. Okay, So let me use this rolled up towel and bring it under your chin, like this. So we're going to do 10 chin tucks, all right? So like this. You are going to exercise the muscles under your jawline, all right? Let's do it 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Do this ten times three sets. Now let's do lower jaw massage. So you're going to use the tips of your fingers and your thumbs. All right, so we are going to just cup your lower jaw with your fingertips and your thumb from the chin going to the outside border of your jaw down towards your neck using your fingertips towards your collarbone or your clavicle, okay? So let's do this 10 times. This will be the second set or the second rep. This is three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, and that is your lower jaw line massage. But if you are really desperate and if you can, try growing a beard. But kidding aside, those are the exercises that you can do to get rid of that double chin. Try to do these exercises four to five times a week and take another selfie after three to four weeks. and. Don't forget to send those comparison pictures in my Instagram, which I'm going to link down below. And if you find this video helpful, please click on that subscribe button, give it a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, suggestions, or comments, type it down below in the comment section, okay? And just a reminder, consistency is the key and never give up. Until next time, bye lang.